How to use digital geometric correction on an uneven projection screen. On a surface like this, you may ask yourself, how can the projection image be correctly displayed on it? In this video, we would like to show you how you can easily correct your projection image by using DGC mapping. In our example, we have an uneven projection screen consisting of two panels positioned at an angle and our Phanon Accurate projector with integrated digital geometric correction. With DGC, it is possible to display an image split with one half on the left projection screen and the other half on the right one. Without digital geometric correction, the image is displayed distorted and does not fit on the projection screen. So how do we correct the projection image? The settings of the DGC are controlled via our software LA Toolbox, where we can define 16 different setups. We enable DGC and choose Setup 1. The DGC window consists of a button panel on the left side for controlling every area of the projection screen individually and the DGC input and output on the right. We would like to divide the projection screen into two areas, one for the left panel and one for the right. So we split the DGC input and select the left side of it to display it on the left panel. Therefore, we must reduce the DGC input by half by moving the corner points to the middle. On the right side, we correct the DGC output, the projection of the image, by clicking on the corner points of the rectangle named ABCD and move each corner point, as seen here, so that the image is projected correctly on the projection area. With Fine at the bottom, we can more precisely define the position of the corner points. This function can also be applied to the DGC input. We have now corrected the projection image and defined that half of it is displayed on the left panel. Now we want to add the right side of the DGC input. Therefore, we click on the upper button next to button 2 and again start with defining the DGC input and output, now for the right projection area. We reduce the DGC input by half again, but this time we move the left corner points to the middle. By clicking on Snap, the corner point clicks into the same position of the already defined DGC input's corner point. Both inputs are now precisely side by side without overlay or gap. Next, we define the DGC output by again clicking on the corner points and moving them to the right position. There are also functions like the zoom buttons plus and minus for zooming in and out. The one to one button is for resetting the DGC input or output back to its original size. By activating the button with the white rectangle, the zoom functions are applied to the activated DGC input or output. We have now corrected the projection image for display onto an uneven projection screen. With the integrated DGC, no laser show controller is needed, and the show can be recorded and played at other locations with varying projection screens. In addition, two projectors located at different positions can project the same content onto the same or different projection screens. With integrated digital geometric correction, our goal is to create a comprehensible 
and user-friendly process that makes projecting images on a wide range of objects possible, allowing you to break the creative boundaries of the past. We at Laser Animation Zollinger, thank you for your attention.